Verse 3, but Elohim came to Abimelech in a dream that night and said, you're about to die because of the woman you've taken as someone else's wife. Now, Abimelech uh, had not come near near her. In other words, there, there was nothing physical there. So he said, uh, Yahweh, will you kill even an upright nation? Didn't he himself say to me, she is my sister? And, and even she herself said, he is my brother. And in doing this, my heart has been pure and my hands innocent. Elohim said to him in the dream, yes, I know that in doing this, your heart was has been pure. In other words, you didn't know the whole thing. And I to have kept you from sinning against me. This is why I haven't let you touch her. So sometimes the Lord says no for a reason. <laughs> he says, no. But please, Lord, no. But Lord, you don't know. No. What if I know? Come on, Lord. No. So he knows. He knows exactly the plan that he has. And, and whenever we look at Avi Melek, he's actually, he said, you're about to die. He said, if you touch her, you're going to die. Because you're, in other words, I have a covenant plan and you cannot break that plan. And so in his mercy, he reveals this to him. 